So what's going on guys, welcome to a tutorial in Adobe Edge Anime. A lot of people have questions with my tutorial where I explain how to do a drop down menu in Edge. With the new features in Edge, this should be a lot easier to explain. So I'm just going to type in some text. So the concept's going to be when somebody hovers over this, they're going to be able to see a drop down menu. Control L, type in menu. In the beginning of the timeline, Control L, type in off. So we have two labels. This is where the menu is going to be off. This is where the person is going to actually see the menu. And what I'll do is Control C for the text, so I have it copied, and then we're going to create ourselves the menu. So this is what the person will see. We're just going to convert this to a symbol. So convert that to a symbol, call that menu. Now obviously I don't want the person seeing this in the beginning, so what's going to happen is this will be turned off. But first, we're going to paste that text that we copied before. So Control V, and it's pasted right on top of the text that we have. You can see that's a little bit darker. That's because you have two layers of text there. So in the beginning, we're going to select on for the text, and then we're going to select off. Now come over here. Remember, we created that menu. That's the whole thing here. Select off, and then over here, select on. So right there, we're showing Edge that we don't want it to appear in the beginning, but we do want to have it here. Now what we'll do is create a trigger for the beginning of the timeline. And that's going to stop this. That way when somebody plays this, they're just going to see the text. Then come over here to the menu, same thing, press stop, and then it's going to stop it over here on the timeline. Right click on the text, open actions, select mouse over, play, and we're going to select menu. Now what will happen is it will play over here on the timeline, then take your menu, open actions, mouse over, it's going to play menu and then we're going to add a mouse out. Select play and it's going to play off. So what happens here is that you hover over this, it'll play the menu and then when you mouse out it'll go back to off. So I'm going to add a cursor style to the text, select the pointer, scrub over here on the timeline, double click the menu. I'm going to type in YouTube. Convert to symbol, close button one, open actions, select click, open URL, and the cool thing about the new features in Edge is that you can right click on this, duplicate the symbol, I'll close button two. Double click on that, change the text. Let's call this Facebook. Right click on this, open actions, select click, open URL. Facebook.com forward slash Adobe Easy. Gonna add a cursor style to both of these also. goes to my YouTube channel and that goes to my Facebook fan page. So I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial on Adobe Edge Animate. If you like to give it a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed, hit that subscribe button and I'll see you guys later. Cheers.